We moved here primarily because of the location. Uh, we love living here in Rosemont. It's the type of neighborhood that we grew up in. And the house itself was adorable. Georgiana came home one day in a cab. I came home in a cab and told them which house it was. And the cab driver said, you live in that house? I come by here all the time and it's the cutest house on the street. And I have to agree with him. I particularly like the fireplace because I'm cold all the time, so it's a nice addition for me. And of course, the fireplace is always adds charm. The new kitchen that we added is really very convenient. We have lots of drawers, we have lots of cupboards, one of which has glass doors so that you can use it for displaying china if you want to. We have uh, double doors onto the deck. We use it basically as a, an early morning place. It's very nice to sit here and, and read the morning paper uh, and uh, have our coffee or tea. We also love the screen porch that's on the front of the house. In fact, it is what sold it to us when we first walked up the stairs. It had wicker furniture on it, and it still does. And I could picture myself sitting there drinking lemonade and eating cookies in the summertime. Well, I always wanted to have my own workshop, and then I built my dream shop, which has uh, radiant heat in the floor uh, and uh, air conditioning. I uh, go to my man cave and get away from the rest of the world. We have a lot of nice amenities here. Not just because of the metro, though that wasn't very important to us, but because it's so close to everything else. It's close to Old Town, it's close to the Eisenhower Valley. I mean, short drives away, you, you touch on all of Alexandria, really. We can see the George Washington Masonic Memorial from our deck here. It's very pretty. It's lit up at night. There's a seasonal uh, farmer's market that's uh, held Wednesday afternoons in the King Street Gardens Park. When we first moved here, King Street was pretty deserted. Down near the river, it was boarded up. There was one restaurant, and there was one gift shop on Prince Street where I could shop, but it was, it was not what it is today. It's completely changed, and it's now a tourist destination. So now everything is booming, and the, the torpedo factory has added a lot to that. On our side of the railroad tracks, we are at home in a lovely neighborhood of the 30s and 40s, and on the other side of the tracks is a booming new city. We have it all, and you can too.